Okay, unpopular opinion. The spray hand spray. Sand hand Sand hand rise. Sand, sand, what the fuck? Sand hand riser. Sand hanitizer. Sand hanitizer. Sand hanitizer. Sand riner. Hand sanitizer. Hand sanitizer. Can I get a bite? I'm not talking about the food, baby. Oh, yeah, I'm talking about shit. <laughs> Other way. Other way. Other way. What would you do with a brain if you had one? I'm going both ways. Other way. What do you mean other way? I'm going this way and then I'm going this way. Try to turn it around. No. Like this. Oh! oh my god! <laughs> Women. <laughs> I am the problem. I went on a date with this guy and he was like, it's getting late. Do you want to come back to my place? And I was like, sure, but I'm not going to sleep with you. Like that's not happening. And he was like, that's totally fine. Just come over. And I was like, cool. So I go to his place. He respects my wishes. He's so nice. He cuddles me all night. And I'm like, are you gay? Huh? Like what? And like, I, he, I just wanted him to like try and then for me to be like, no, you know what I mean? I wasn't gonna sleep with him, I, but I just, now I feel ugly. You, something is wrong with you! <laughs> God damn it! You can't make this shit up! Here's how I make steak for my wife's best friend Jacob when he comes over to visit. He usually drops by last minute and only stays for an hour or two. My wife likes me to wear noise canceling headphones in case they're talking about something private. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Sometimes if it gets too late, he'll stay over, but our couch is too firm for his back. She thinks I'm doing her a favor, but I don't tell her I think the couch is really comfortable. Good night, babe. You a simp! I got y'all one. I didn't want to believe it. This one hurt my feelings. Because if a man could look this damn good, we're all in trouble. But a lot of y'all kept throwing it at me, kept saying, so I checked it out. But Megan Fox, she's a man. She's admitted it several times. She got that big old Adam's apple that goes up and down. Broke my heart, people. All I see is Bumblebee and her leaning over the hood. I mean, that was a bad one. But Megan Fox is a man. We ain't safe. Ain't none of us fucking safe. Kayla, come on. So men don't open car doors anymore? How the f do you think I got in here? Good question. If I'm dating you and you never compliment me, never tell me I'm beautiful, never make me feel good about myself, like, what does that mean? Like, should I end the relationship? Are you not right for me? Do you not find me attractive? Why do men be with women that 
they don't compliment or don't make them feel beautiful 100% of the time. Is that a red flag? Like, are we in the wrong position? Like, put me on game. Because I'm not sure. Like, how does that work? Do do some men, are, are some men just nonchalant? Y'all just feel like, okay, she already knows she's beautiful. I don't need to tell her. Why would y'all not compliment your girl all the time? Just help me out. Picture this. Day by day, I compliment you by telling you stuff like, you're the best thing that has happened to me. You're the love of my life. You're gorgeous. You're beautiful. I don't know what I'd do without you. Wouldn't those compliments lose value? And it means I'm comfortable around you. I love you. And I don't want to make that ego bigger because I know it will destroy our relationship. And some women don't want to hear it. How old are you? 29. 28. Are you ladies single? Not, not really. As you can tell, really like... Uh... <laughs> Very single. Why do you think you haven't found a man yet? I'm picky as fuck. So what expectations do you have for your future man? He needs to be cute with a sense of humor. Cute with a sense of humor, sir. Okay, what else? <laughs> Pay the fucking bill on the first date, please. Does he have to make 100K at least? I mean, make more than I'm making, so yes. What about his height? Six, seven. <laughs> You're not being realistic right now. Okay, 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 okay. Five eight. Five eight is okay. Does he have to pay for everything? Yes. What gives you the right? I have a lot to offer. I cook, I clean. Um, ass looks great. You know. Are you gonna give that man kids one day? Yes. But you're 28 now. Am I expired? <laughs> well, that's what I was gonna ask you. No, 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 I'm not. No. I'm, um, like fine wine, honey. We were so what's, fine wine. what's the latest then? You'd want to have a child. 32. You're a woman over 27, it's time to sell. Oh! If you're a woman over 30, it's time to put some, it's the sign, it's time to mark this shit on 50% off. Damn! If you're over 35, it's time to put that shit on clearance. If you have 40, it's time to put that shit at the outlet. If you have 50, Salvation Army. <laughs> oh! I had a woman, swear to God, hand to God. In my comment section a year ago, talk about, I love your program. I, I, You know, I'm getting my head together, my mind right. And I think in the next couple of years, I'll be in the position to uh, be open a, enough again to try to get with a high value man and get married. That woman was 70. Talking about she's getting her mind together. And in a couple of years... She should be ready to date and she will be looking for a provider male. Do you want to see my new Lego? This one also moves and it goes boing, 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 boing. And it's got a kickstand. This one's got a kickstand. And it's got cool exhaust. Um, this one doesn't shift because I think I broke it. <laughs>